Welcome back to sports and happy Halloween, Senla. It's time for our ACA Athlete of the Week. This week, our athlete comes from right across the Red River at Pineville High School, where his leadership is helping the Rebels break records. We have an ACA Athlete of the Week here. Uh, it's, it's an athlete that's, you know, it's a regional deal, so it's, it's, a, it's a big deal, and it's, it's, uh, it's definitely earned. It goes to a goes to somebody that's reached the 1,000 yard mark in rushing for the first time since 2009 in our program's history, as far back as I can tell, and that's Aiden Tate right here. Aiden Tate is a junior running back for the Pineville Rebels who has stepped up as a quarterback this season due to a teammate's injury, breaking the single game rushing record against Tioga in week three with 407 yards and broke the 1,000 yard rushing mark for a single season week eight against West Monroe. I'm definitely excited. Reaching 1,000 yards was pretty pretty amazing no never done before Aiden is a humble leader on the gridiron giving his teammates recognition for every milestone he accomplishes I'm happy for my teammates to be with me and experience it I got a family behind me I'm happy to experience this uh this journey with them I'm happy to be here with them I don't wouldn't want to be with anybody else except them you know I want to continue getting better with them and uh, you know do better as it is so many times in today's day and age you know people will do great things but it's only for their glory they do it for Twitter or, or Instagram glory but Aiden's not like that comes to work you know and, and wants to get better every day he wants to be coached he wants to be pushed you know he's not afraid of you know constructive criticism I feel like it's um it's an honor really to you know block for him and and get those a thousand yards for him you know he, he's really humble about it you know you don't really hear him speaking about it a lot but um you know when it happens you know it's a it's a it's an honor towards him and us aiden also leads his team off the field by being a role model for his peers in the classroom and in the weight room uh, he's an energetic energetic guy he's uh he works hard in the weight room and everything he kind of keeps to himself he's kind of quiet uh and just just works hard but he He's a good kid. He just does what he needs to do, and I can admire that. Never had a discipline issue with Aiden, I don't think. You know, I've never had a teacher complain about him. He makes good grades. Uh, he, he comes from a good family that pushes him to be the best that he can be, both on and off the field, you know, and that goes a long way. Since Aiden is only a junior, his team believes he will continue his success throughout the rest of the season and on to the next year, hoping to expand upon his legacy as a Pineville Rebel. The legacy that he's leaving here, it's a... Uh... It's one that's gonna stay put for a while, hopefully. Just reassures the seniors that are leaving now that, you know, we have somebody behind us that's gonna, you know, keep doing what they're supposed to do and, you know, working hard. I'm gonna keep pushing. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep training. I'm gonna keep breaking more records if I try. I'm still gonna try to beat my, uh, break my own record for this year or next year, it don't matter. We're big on leaving a legacy and leaving a mark behind. We're big on, on you know, player leadership. You know, the more they the more they can lead positively in, in that building on our field, then then the better for us all. And Aiden is one of those people that, that take the torch, uh, that show his teammates how to do it right by example. He's not a talker. Um, and so you know it's genuine because it is by example. And, and uh, that's what we need now. It's what we need tomorrow. And it's what we'll need in the year going forward. For his record-breaking performances and undeniable leadership on and off the field, Aiden Tate is this week's ACA Athlete of the Week. And that's a look at sports. We'll be back right after the break.